Hey guys, today I want to show you how I add excitement to MP3 beats when it comes to mixing just a two track with vocals. I'll be using the new released Neutron 5. I've been beta testing for a couple of months now and it's just one of my favorite plugins for this purpose. Let's jump into the session. Up early like 8 30 in the mirror, like don't be cool, stay nerdy. Throw a shirt on my head like it ain't dirty. PJs don't count, I'm on day 30. Plastic bull. A pretty cool track from uh, Decure. We have just the two track, we don't have the track out. Let me show you how you can add back excitement to your MP3 beats. One amazing thing that I like doing in this situation is use a multi band transient shaper. I usually like three bands. One for the bass, one for the mids, and one for the top end. Up early like 8 30 in the mirror, like don't be cool, stay nerdy. Throw a shirt on my head like it ain't dirty. PJs don't count, I'm on day 30. Plastic bowl for the cap and crunch. The same thing that I'll have for lunch. Till then I'm outside with a punch. Hop on my bike over leaves that crunch. I've got a hunch. There's one to be had and evil around. I thought I would pedal down the street and even it out. I won't let it fly like the bush. They're beating the around. If it's corrupt after dark, I'm not keeping it down. What's quiet now, I'm gonna stand. I walk up, karate chop, a sleeping homeless man. I don't even care, you don't own this land. But don't do drugs, it might own your plans. I'm just adding a bit more punch to the instrumental and a bit more sustain just to the low end. And since this is a boom bop track, I need that snare in your face. The mid range is so important. If you are boosting it with a multi band transient uh, shaper, then you are golden. You are adding back that excitement to the snare, to the kick. Another thing that I like uh, doing is use the sculpture module on the instrumental. Let's go with all purpose, add fullness and see what results we are getting with this. In the mirror, like don't be cool, stay nerdy. Throw a shirt on my head, like it ain't dirty. PJs don't count, I'm on day 30. Plastic bowl for the cap and crunch. The same thing that I'll have for lunch. Till then, I'm outside with a punch. Hop on my bike over leaves that crunch. I've got now we can use this in transient sustain mode, mid side. I love transient sustain mode. Got a hunch, there's one to be had and evil around. I thought I would pedal down the street and even it out. I won't let it fly like the bush, they're beating the round. If it's corrupt after dark, I'm not keeping it down. What's quiet now, I'm gonna stand. I walk up, karate chop, a sleeping homeless man. I don't even care, you don't own this land. But don't do drugs, it might own your plans. Up early like 8 30 in the mirror, like don't be cool, stay nerdy. Throw a shirt on my head like it ain't dirty. PJs don't count, I'm on day 30. Plastic bowl for the cap and crunch. The same thing that I'll have for lunch. Till then, I'm outside with a. We can use this in mid side too. But I like it in transient sustain just to add that small touch of excitement back to the instrumental. One new module in uh, Neutron 5 is the density module. This is upward compression and it's just beautiful on this sort of material. When you are trying to add, well, a bit more density to your source. With the density module, you are bringing up the low level. Day 
dirty Plastic bowl for the cap and crunch The same thing that I'll have for lunch Till then I'm outside with a punch Hop on my bike And even a touch of upward compression from the density module adds some fullness back into the instrumental. Another thing that I like doing is adding an EQ in transient sustain mode or mid side. It depends on the instrumental, but you can carve out the nasty parts, or you can enhance the instrumental like that. And lastly, what I've been doing for a really long time is multi-band clipping when it comes to two tracks. Yeah, it's something that I like doing because it gives me the ability to focus my clipping. Sometimes I want to clip more the top end, sometimes I want to clip the low end. And again with Neutron 5, we have the clipping either in stereo mid-side or transient sustain, which is an amazing feature. Right now, the clipper is in hard clipping mode. So we are just taming the peaks, but we can add a bit of saturation with the soft clip boost. And just like that, I've managed to add some life back into a simple two track instrumental with all the modules you have the mix so you can blend the dry signal with the process signal. Neutron 5 is such an amazing tool and my favorite module is the new clipper. I know I have a lot of clippers, but none of those clipper work in mid side, transient sustain mode, multi band at the same time. It's really nice to have that sort of control. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe, drop a like, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. If you want some extra content, you can go over to my Patreon page. I really appreciate the support. Cheers.